I would say Taiwan is pretty much the only choice you have right now to study Chinese. Foreigners, I think, want to come to a more uh, open society, democratic society. These characters are incredibly old, so when you're writing them, you're basically writing down history. It managed to preserve the Chinese traditional culture in many, many aspects. This allows you to understand the culture and language even more. It just feels very comfortable, even if you haven't been here for a very long time. Learning the language is important not only to learn the superficial characters, but also the, the profound meaning and the cultural significance. Simplified Chinese is easier to write, maybe easier to remember, but it doesn't have the meaning like implemented in its image. The traditional ones are more complete and holistic. So when I see the characters, I really feel the picture or the, the story behind them. Taiwan is a free country, which you're able to express your own feelings and ideas. The internet's not restricted, which makes studying easier. In Taiwan, I have never run into any freedom of speech problems. There's not much choice if you want to study Chinese in a free environment without having to be afraid for being arrested. Or my favorite teaching method was a role play activity. My teachers and my classmates would each play parts of diplomatic representatives or politicians. And the discussions we had during class were thought-provoking and lighthearted. When I was studying the Simplified Chinese, I felt that it only teaches you like practical daily Chinese, but nothing with a bit more depth not to mention the so-called uh, sensitive issues. So while studying, I've always felt like I missed something. I think it's very different than learning uh, traditional Chinese in Taiwan. I think it's the best choice if you want to live in Asia. From now, you should come here. If you cannot come to Taiwan, you can also study Chinese in your own country. country.